Hello, I am Anmay Jagdab, Principal Product Manager at Snowflake. Today, I am going to show you how easily you can build applications using the Native Apps Framework. For this demo, we are going to continue from where we left off with Adrian's Ad Revenue app in the previous video. As an application developer at Sportsco, I can leverage the Native Application Framework to package this Ad Revenue model and distribute it on Snowflake's global marketplace for all customers in the data cloud. Let's take a look at how we'll do this. Right from the Snowflake worksheet, I can compose my application. The model that Shri built is available to me as a UDF. Also, the streamlit object that Adrian created can be used for my application's UI. Now let's create an installer stored procedure for this application that will set up an app in the consumer account. The installer uses logging capability from the native application framework to debug the installation. Let's package the app using Snowflake's secure sharing feature. I've already created a listing to publish this app. This is where I add critical information that consumers can see when evaluating and purchasing my app. It's also where I pick a pricing model. For the ad revenue app, I'll pick a monthly price of $100 and $1 every time the prediction is saved by the consumer of this app. I'll cap the max monthly bill to $150. I'll now publish it on Snowflake Marketplace, where more than 6,000 customers in the data cloud network can discover and use it. Now that my app is live, let's take a look at the consumer experience. Snowflake Marketplace not only has thousands of live ready to query datasets, but now also includes applications ranging from data models, data enrichment, and ETL connectors, all using the native apps framework. Here's the application that I created. The listing description gives example use cases and billing model details. Let's buy it. The consumer can connect their historical spend data by granting permissions on it to the application. And just like that, the application reports historic spend across channels and revenue. I can adjust the allocations to determine which spending scenario will be best for the next month based on historical data. This allocation looks good. Let's select Save Allocations. Here we can see these allocations and predicted ROI are written to the historic data table. What's really powerful is that the consumer doesn't need to share my data with Sportsco and their data never left Snowflake. This means they can start getting insights immediately without risking data silos or security issues. As you can see, in just a few minutes, we took a popular internal application, productized it, and unlocked an entirely new revenue stream for Sportsco. Thank you for watching. If you want to learn more, please sign up to snowflake.com/nativeapps and subscribe to our YouTube channel.